Nobody knows really whether they're doing the right thing or the wrong thing. People who think they're always right, they're terrible people. When you are reasonably balanced, make a decision, throw your life into it, something wonderful will happen. My question to you is, uh, whenever we make decisions, there is always a right or a wrong decision. Whether the decision taken is right or wrong is only eventually re realized. How would I know uh, I took the right decision and how will I know if I'm uh, taking the right decision or wrong decision while making it? But why are you copying a question? Copying it, uh, <laughs> that's what I had in mind, so I wrote it down. Okay. No, no, I've… Uh, I was never so interested in the examinations, I never bothered. But I saw when I was in college, lot of people inside their sleeve, here, there, everywhere they've written and uh, all kinds of chits and things, but they were all copying answers. <laughs> Question you copy because… No, no, I'm not trying to make a comment on you because this is everywhere. Because you are creating such a level of conflict within yourself for every simple thing, that you think you could always be doing something wrong, something wrong, something wrong. Well, joyfully do something wrong, it's okay. Hello? Nobody know, knows really whether they're doing the right thing or the wrong thing. Do they know for hundred percent? No. So don't bother yourself too much about is this right, is this wrong. It is just that when you do something, is this bringing well-being to me and everybody around me? That's all your concern is. People who think they're always right, they're terrible people. You produce tyrants out of this. I am always right, I made all the right decisions in my life. This is a tyrant, this is not a human being. It becomes a very ugly human being who does everything right. You don't have to do right things, just be a little more human. Just make sure when you do something, it's good for you and good for everybody around you, that's all. It is right, it is wrong, who is to decide? If it's bringing well-being to everybody, it is the right thing, isn't it? Nobody can decide what is right and what is wrong because for a thousand years they've debated the same things and nobody has come to a conclusion as to what is right and wrong. And people who believe they're doing the right things, they did the most horrendous things to each other, always. So instead of looking at right and wrong, which is a consequence of a morality that you… in which you believe, why don't you awaken the humanity within you? Why don't you become a living humanity? Humanity means just this, already we spoke about this. Animal nature means fixing boundaries. Human nature means expanding or including everybody into your boundaries because this is a natural longing. Wherever you are, you want to be something more, something more. What is this? This is because your intelligence has come to a place where it doesn't like boundaries. It wants to expand. This is human nature. Human nature is naturally inclusive. Animal nature is exclusive, it wants to fix boundaries. So instead of being in boundaries of right and wrong, even if somebody is wrong, let's include them and do the best we can. Because the moment you think I'm doing all the right things, those… everybody looks wrong in your life. See, please sincerely address this and see, most people are in this condition. Except themselves, everybody is wrong somewhere. If everybody is wrong and only you're right, it's a sign of madness, it is not a sign of being right. So do not waste your time in right decisions, wrong decisions. When you are reasonably balanced and clear and happy, not frustrated about something, make a decision, throw your life into it, something wonderful will happen. You may not do the right thing, but you may do a great thing, you may do a wonderful thing, that's good enough. How far will I go? What will happen? Well, that depends on various things, your own intelligence, your competence and the times in which we exist. You should not discount the times in which we exist. At different times in history, different things take off. We may be in sync with it, what we are may be appreciated today or what we are may be appreciated tomorrow or what we are may be appreciated after we are gone. But whatever we did in our life, we did with total involvement because life is in its involvement. 
Life is not in its correctness. Your involvement must be unbridled. Whatever you do, see how everybody's well-being is included in this. If you are an inclusive process and you're involved, it is fine. Are you right or wrong? Right or wrong? Till the last day of your life, you cannot really decide what is right and wrong because there will always be another set of people who say this is wrong, isn't it? <laughs>